there he is. There's the man I wanted to see, Mr. Superstar himself. Oh, man. Now, you, you really had me going there for a second, but you really pulled it off. Uh, you know, I'm glad you enjoyed it. Listen, still, I did want to talk to you about something. How about we attach some flamethrowers, like four of them, at the end of the stage, right? And when you're in the darkness, all the fire just comes up and... Wait, man, Danny, people are going to crazy wait, stop, 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 stop. Okay, so you want to change it. Oh, uh, come on, man. Don't start with me. People are going to love no, no, that. No, leave that fire stuff to John. I, I don't, I don't want to catch on fire, you know? It is not as dangerous as you think. Yes, it is as dangerous. Like, I mean, I dare you to name one person that's ever been, like, seriously injured by fire. Michael Jackson. That, that was a long time ago, and that, that was in a commercial, and they probably even did that on purpose, you know, tell publicity you what, stunts. Tell you what, why don't you talk to Faye? Hey, Faye, we kind of wanted to liven up your hubs with his act, so we kind of lit him on fire. I see your point. But that ain't nothing a little convincing from a loving husband, can't you? Ah? Uh, hey, that's a, that's a hell of a picture. Yeah. Well, since you came back, I haven't really talked to you about it, but... No, no, Danny, don't, just, don't, don't just start let, this let now, finish, come on. I just want to say that, you know, if... Dad had been here, he'd... He'd be proud. But hey, you know what? Tomorrow's a big day, and you gotta go see Faye with the baby and whatnot, so I'll just leave you to it, all right? And think about that fire. Are you all right? Are you all right? Listen. I know I've said it before, but... Ben, please. I just, I didn't mean any. Hey, sorry about the way. Morning. Well, Mr. Pagliacci, I've asked you here today because your lab results are in. We should be able to see how the tumor has responded to radiation and chemo that we started you a couple of weeks back. So, let's see what we got and hope for the best. Mr. Pagliacci, the tumor is not responding as we hoped for. In fact, it seems to have grown, and because of the size and location of the mass, surgery is no longer an option. So what now? Son, do you understand what I've just told you? Yeah, the treatment's not working, so what's the next move? Ben, we've hit a wall. There's nothing else we can do. What I would recommend is that you start making arrangements. I can refer you to the staff psychologist. How much time does he have? At the most, a month, give or take. But I am very sorry, sir. <laughs>
We could talk to other doctors tomorrow. There's got to be one that's willing to operate. Just forget about it. Forget about it? What do you mean, forget about it? You want to give up? There's got to be something we can do. You can't just roll over. I won! Just please leave me alone. I said leave. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, come see the saddest act you will ever see. <laughs> what are you smiling at? Well, you are is nothing but a joke. A big fucking joke! Watch it! What's the matter with you? Everything! Christ, man, you reek. How am I supposed to put you up there now, huh? I won't let you ruin the integrity of the second person by having some drunk-ass clown. Oh, no, not the integrity. I swear to God, Ben, you either sober up or you'll force me to... You'll for yeah. force you to what? Kick me out, kick your own brother out, or you give a shit about us, this stupid-ass circus? I quit! What would you have me do, huh? 37 years! 37 fucking years has the circus been in our family! You can't just throw that away, all that tradition, that sacrifice! Well, you know what? Lucky for you, I'm not throwing it away. I'm dying. So swallow that tradition. So, so that's it. Just gonna give up? You know what? Go ahead and do that. I just didn't think you were such a coward. I'm just glad Dad ain't here to have his heart broken all over again by his own coward son! What'd you say? Did I stutter? Take that back. Make me. I said take that back! <laughs> Let go of me! Get off! This is doing so good. What more do you want from me? I feel so alone. You think this has been easy for me? So ever since dad died, you left. All I had was a stupid circus. And now you're back and I thought we could be a family again. And now you're leaving me. You ain't coming back. I didn't know you felt that way. Hey, what... What I said about... I'm quitting, I... I didn't mean it. Yeah, I... I didn't mean it either. About that. It was his boy. Do me a favor. Turn for the worst, you take care of that kid. Man, you, you don't even gotta no, say no, that. No, no, no. Listen to me. You take care of him. You give him everything. 
deserved it. I will. Um, oh. oh shit! Phase at the hospital, man. We gotta get. We gotta get going. Come on, give me your hand. You're drunk. Come on. At least help me out, Ben. Ben. Help! Ben, don't do this to me! Help! Yeah, well, there's a theater close by, so that's pretty nice. Well, oh, watch it. Sorry. Where do you want it? Anywhere, just completely down there. Yeah. So, okay, I'll talk to you later. Okay, bye. Where, where do you want us to put the? Uh... Um, I was thinking about putting them over there on the table, and we could just leave them there. Listen, I just really wanted to thank you for. Well, hey, stop it. Everything. Just. Hey. It's been. Forget about it. Family. Um.